getting ready to start. Winners finals. Winners finals. I haven't seen either of these players in a while. We've been going through loser sets. Yeah. Interested to see how how they're playing now because Dreffin was looking real, real hot. He was playing really well. I think what will be huge for Kiyoshi is just these combos. I think Kiyoshi's neutral is there. The games that they won versus Essie and the games they won before that were just, when they fix their combo game, like the all tippers, like, you know, like getting those conversions, that's when they were winning. And Sheik, that is very important. You need to get the, like, up tip combos at low percent, uh, good chains to get them off stage and such, and keep them off the ground. Because yeah. you're gonna get walled out if you play North neutral normally, and you're not like trying to juggle them. Or, I think uh, Jeff is going to be the ultimate test for those kinds of things. Uh, yeah, he definitely knows how to make it annoying to uh, like stay alive and make it hard for his opponent to kill. Oh yeah. Drevin was living to like 130 versus every box. Every stop. And just going off of the set we saw with Kiyoshi before, uh, if I could definitely see Drevin just living to just absurd percents, and that'll be the name of the game. Yeah. And just he'll be able to take huge uh, leads from that, and it'll be hard for Kiyoshi to keep up. So that's going to be a huge part of it, is just. I love this screen, the by the way. That screen is so cool. <laughs> what, it the don't, like, sound the, this, the, the sound stereo on, it's so good. You like It doesn't feel like it's a part of Melee, but then you go in and it's like, the so overall UI is so neat. It's yeah, the cool parts. And like this menu, like it like flips like a cube. It's, it's so cool. It's just so ahead of its time. <laughs> Although, I, not really. I mean, it's still for the like, game Wait, is it, that was Wait, that was the game. Wow. That, that was the game, and Dreffin just started off with Shane. Awesome. And uh, something to note is we do have a bit of a port, port priority thing going on. Yes, he yes, they, is they, on four. That's huge. That that is seen as like the biggest matchup in the game for port priority. Yes. And Jeffrey with an early game with Needles. At least for the aspect of it with uh, the like throws. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And yeah, if you don't One know, it's, early. it's not this super like serious oh. game breaking thing, but the the up throw up tilts do get um, a bit easier because of the port. Uh, it's just a one thing difference. Yeah. So uh, it doesn't make a tangible oh. difference every time, but it's just great having a little bit of extra wiggle room, especially in a game like this. Nice. <laughs> just dead. I don't know what happened there. Oh. I he got straight somewhere. down there. Needs an early kill here, or else Griffin's just gonna live forever. I don't like that we just have no music now. This is yeah, <laughs> it's a bit uncomfortable. <laughs> it feels like so much more just awkward and like. It's just like the sword swings are left empty in the air. Yeah, they just echo into the background. Reverse up till they're not closing it out. Dref, like like we said, Dreffin's living early, Kyoshi's not. And something cool that I saw Dreffin do there was the beer versus needles while recovering yes. to keep back a little bit uh, instead of maybe thinking about, oh, I could snap to ledge easier, like maybe go for a little reversal, which we did see a lot of reversals from Dreffin uh, in the last set, mm -hmm. um, hitting, uh, who was it, SE off the ledge? Uh, just kept like forward airing off the off the ledge and just getting reversals from that. I think it. I don't think Dreffin played S. Okay, who who was it? I think it was just Joe. Just Joe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because Joe's just waiting on the ledge and he'd just get these random forward airs right when he ran out of invincibility. Dreffin just. This is a classic. We've been saying it all tournament. Dreffin gets a one-stock lead, it's lights out. And no one's been able to stop him, so we have to see Yashi like make a push onto stopping that. But really Dreffin's looking to close it out now. This game. That's it. Clean. What went wrong? Dreffin lived li Dreffin lived a while on his second stock. Kiyoshi like that was also just a very odd game, I feel like, as well. It's just kind of, uh, the very start of it just kind of uh, started off. There it is. Chain again. <laughs> Randomly. He's just going to do every start of every game like that, isn't he? He's a madman. He doesn't care. No jump, by the way. This guy's hurting Kiyoshi. Uh, 
Luckily for Kiyashi, got sent inwards to the stage instead. Oh, Ooh. just trying to get away from the second special. Not care. Oh, wow. What the great CC there, just like not to be afraid of the ledge drops and just getting a kill off. Yeah, I'm interested to see how much of a theme that'll be for this set. Or just the, oh. uh, the, the ledge traps, um, just keeping Marth pinned to the ledge like that. Because Marth is not very good off the edge. Uh, you got your uh, ledge dash up tilts and your forward airs or nares from the ledge, but uh, that stuff is pretty telegraphed. You don't have that many options, and they aren't that good, especially compared to other people like Fox. Wow. And Jeffen's just keeping Kiyoshi off the ledge with these needles. And it's been really oppressive for the oh. first game and this one. Jeffen's forward tilts have been killer in starting like these combos. Like You need to get Marth to that like 70% range to get those down throws. And through the use of like these just quick conversions off of forward tilt. Into, it, into itself, basically, it's just been crucial for Jeffen's kills. Classic Marth will be there. Gets poofed. And I think that's like the first forward smash we've seen uh, like yeah. that. Um, that is something I've noticed is we haven't been getting forward Not letting it like rip. That. Although I feel like forward smash would be good against someone like Drefin with those spot dodges and such. Yeah. I feel like it's a very good call with like that. Ooh, oh, spot like dodge, yeah. Around each other. Spot dodge there. That's hilarious. There were about like three hitboxes there that just missed barely. I'm surprised we didn't see a counter at all. Up tilt kill. Up tilt kill. More up tilt kills from Kiyashi as mentioned uh, in the previous set. Good throw. Needs to get a good combo going and then on like an early gimp or just like a forward smash tipper. Yep. I think uh, Drefin knows this somewhat and is staying uh, Oh, got greedy there. No the jump. Stage. There's no jump on Tsuyoshi here. Reads the landing. All right, and this the is needle. Oh, but gets clipped. Yeah. Great. That was nice. Seems a down throw and then that'll, that'll probably close the game. Reverse forward air like that is always juicy. Jeffen's really what? Yeah, just uh, goes in after like. On platform, not quite. Oh, should be death that should be it. Yeah, 2-0 so far for Jeffen. Gosh, the forward air angle is just so, so sh harsh that just even if you're hitting a stage like that, you just get plummeted just down and away. You just can never recover. Choosing Yoshi's this time. I think I respect that. You need to kill earlier. Yeah, like that's definitely that has been shown to be the problem. Love this chain. Every game, Drevin does not care. <laughs> Drevin's trying to make this statement. I'm the, I'm top in Midwest. You can't stop me. Like that. That's what that chain is. Oh my gosh! And you gotta grab when uh, Kiyoshi is behind. But uh, yeah, the, the the early kills should come a little easier here. Or the earlier kills, I should say. Yeah. Um, definitely good choice. Staying good call out. Either. Gonna get a lot of this. A lot of percent. Nice forward tilt. Yeah, good forward tilt. Not too committal and like a longer lasting hitbox than forward tilt. We'll see if this gets a kill. Should. Ooh, uh, maybe not high enough percent. Maybe. Mm, no, not quite. Oh, not reading the recovery that well. There should be it though. Yeah. Jeffen's really been great at like, pulling out Kiyoshi's landing options. Obviously, like you need to be doing that versus Mark. It's really tough to land against Sheik, um, especially as Mark. A lot of other characters, like a lot of other like the reason that we say that like that Sheik like destroys like lower tier characters. One of the main factors is that catching those landings so well. Yeah. Like Luigi, like Peach, maybe not Peach, but one of the aspects of that match is that. Like, and you just got that like multi tool of a, of a down throw. It feels like it just has something, yeah. has something on just every character. Oh, Ooh, yeah. Calls them out. Doesn't kill the yeah. tipper. Oh, that that tilts that enough. Kill. Even game on Yoshi's. Got another up tilt kill. Yeah, these forward tilts been massive for Jeffen. Wow, pushing him off with the light shield. 
Oh, what a call out. Trying to go with the down smash. Should have like a, oh, a grab or a, here. This a is spot dodge. So many jabs and spot dodges. And wow, holds on in on the four days. Awesome. Randall shenanigans? Randall, sure. Oh, oh my gosh. That was some movement. <laughs> I thought for sure he was dead after that nair. Oh my god. Yoshi wants to get nope. back. You gotta hold out eventually, yeah. <laughs> it's so it's so hard like rewire like you just want back. I, I just thought we'd get like a forward tilt end there, but he just kept chatting. Oh wow. Slide off from like weeks hit of up smash. Yeah, you big up here maybe? No, not a juggle. Oh, and he's crouching under the God. bears now. And these lack stock, stock situations, Jeffen plays so patient, and it makes the opponent like freak out. Like it's, he's so calm. Yeah, he's so just chill about it. He's looking to close it off. Wow, oh, tech roll read. read. Jeffen's in grand finals of Bought Me 21 right now. Winner's yeah. side. Wow, well play. Man, that was, that was crazy. Good stuff. Good stuff for sure. Wow, played well. Walks away in glory, knowing that whoever awaits him, like he's 